episode two. Uh, we are going to do some farming today. So, as usual, we will try to keep these uh, episodes to 30 to 45 minutes. Uh, that might give us two episode, two missions today. We will see. Uh, we're going to start off with I Let Love In. I Let Love In. Uh, working for the Creed. Which may or may not be a great choice. I don't know. Uh, the heir of the richest landlord of Deek is currently employed on training maneuvers with the planetary militia. His recent spouse is pregnant and afraid that the marriage will end after he discovers who the real father is, leaving her and the future child destitute in the periphery. We will help We will help her to provide for the kid's future in exchange, obviously, for a portion of the inheritance. Kill the heir and the rest of the militia lance, and we'll offer you a share as well. So, heading in, um, it is, this is vanilla, which means mech parts are probably the most effective way of getting uh, money. So we are just going to go full salvage, 5 out of 23. Uh, we have 180 ton to limit. So we're going to put the Shadowhawk, the Blackjack, the Vindicator. That puts us at 145. And we're bringing the Spider, puts us at 175. All right. So OBG gets the extra maneuver, the extra evasion pips. We'll put him there. Shadowhawk is going to get some. Uh, he's going to be up front with his medium laser and AC5 tricky tricks. Uh, Blackjack has a lot of options uh, with his AC2s to split up and medium lasers, and the Vindy will do what the Vindy does with Decker, who hopefully doesn't die. Alright, let's go! So as you may have noticed on the Leopard, we only have six slots. Uh, there is no option to expand that, so we only ever get, well, not ever, until we get the Argo, we only have six Command base slots. Initiated. So we're gonna have to really pick and choose what uh, mechs we keep around. Oh, there'll likely be reinforcements. Thank you, I wanted more. All right, so we're probably gonna trigger as soon as we step forward, so let's go ahead and step on my up. Way. Let me uh, fix the setting here. Oh, that's still there. Okay. All right. Good to go. I thought uh -huh. they were gonna know we were here, but apparently position confirmed. Not. All right. Moving out. There they are. So something's down there. Get a shot if you do that, but I'm gonna No sweat. You. Nope. Alright, so you have a PPC. It's probably better for you to stay up high. And spider is gonna come down and get out of the way around here. Alright, we'll see what we're dealing with around here. So he's got one guy going on four. Heads up, Spider. You've got hostile contacts inbound. All right. So as usual, there are reinforcements which it says are behind them. So that's a commando. So far, that's all we have. Let's uh, let them go. All right, commando's going to run up, shoot my shadowhawk. Behemoth is piloting there. No biggie there. Ready for right. orders. This is a half skull mission. So. Let's see if we can punch this guy in the head. 85 damage from that. Position good. confirmed. My way and took out an arm. Inflicted some heavy damage. Waiting for orders. Uh, I guess that'll work. Don't need to tell me twice. Get on the side here. And he's already... Alright. Came all the way down. So did apparently you, the you initial patrol was it? just that commando. Yes, Commander. So, uh, let's get... closer. I copy. So the reinforcements are coming up. Alright. 
So, there he is. It's a Javelin 10A. So the 10A is a LRM-15 Javelin, which is actually not a bad thing at all to have. Um, let's go ahead and bring this guy forward. All weapons committed. All right, that didn't do much. No damage detected. What's up, boss? Right. So we can't jump very far. So let's get up here. That's not bad. Took him right in the center torso. Solid connection on that one. Waiting on you, Commander. Alright. I read you, Commander. Moving out. And... Got it. Took off an arm. Another hit like that and you're toast. Waiting for orders. Back here, make the shot. On target. That was a miss. Oh, that was a center torso. And he's also down. eliminated. All right, quick and easy. Mission successful. I mean, when they only send two lights at you, it's not hard. But it was a it was a half skull. So what do you expect? All right, we obviously took too much salvage for that, as we have five picks and it's just a commando and a javelin, and some jump jets. So. Not great, but also took no time, makes no takes no repairs, so we can go straight into the next one. All right, kick off your shoes, make yourself comfortable, and we'll go straight into bureaucracy, the drug of civilization. This is a recovery mission. One of our people has fallen ill and is seeking treatment at a private clinic run by the pirates. We put, we're not comfortable with his current medical care. We'd like you to take a mech lance and pick him up, even if he objects. You should also avoid discussing any unpaid bills claimed by the pirate med techs. And there might be also might also might be also additional administrative obstacles to his departure. Those will eventually be settled in the future, but we will cover all costs in his speedy re retrieval back to us. So I'm sending in a lance of mechs to pick up a guy at quick care and blast my way out without paying the bills. This seems like a great plan. All right, we're gonna go three out of 15, four out of 15, four out of 19. Uh, let's go. Yeah. All right, fine, go full. All right, same group as last time and we're off. I just love this particular intro of send a mech lance in to pick up a guy from the pirate med center. Forget, forget the bills, just blast your way out. Command interface initiated. All right. All we have to do is occupy that and work our way out, but it's not going to be that easy, of Time course. Time to get paid. Time to get paid. All right. Bring the mechs around. Affirmative. In a nice little line here. All right. So it looks like there's not going to be anyone around here until position confirmed. We pick up the dude. Oh, never mind. I lied. Sometimes these will spawn when you enter here, and other times they will spawn. Uh, now they're already there. It depends. All right, so we got another commando here. Uh, whatever this is, I think we're gonna reserve down. Let him come to us. Good to go. All right. Well, whatever it was, it didn't want to come to us. So.
Doesn't look like I can walk. I guess I can maybe walk down here. I can't tell. Acknowledged. Alright, I'm just gonna walk up and shoot him. Copy that. So this guy's running a medium laser and an AC2. I hear ya. Got it. Nice damage. Is that a head hit? Yes, Commander. Not. Location confirmed. So the nice thing about this mod, you'll notice, um, you do get target size uh, penalties for be, to be hit, but um, height is higher or lower is plus one, minus one, and um, you don't get any penalties for moving. So target confirmed. I really want to move you in, but I don't see any other way to get a shot on you. Oh, that's a good spot right there. Alright, let's jump into here. Yep. Pick up the target. I hope that doesn't spawn anybody else. Alright, took off the right arm and the right torso and got some damage on the center. The asset is in hand, Commander. Good work. Alright, so that commando is very angry. And what else do we have out here? The second one is a Kintaro UNK. So UNK stands for, let me find it here real quick. So a UNK is a Where is it? A UNK stands for a unconditionally nasty killer, is what it stands for. So this guy has, <laughs> so he's running quad machine guns, two medium lasers, an SRM-6, two SRM-4s, LR and an LRM-5. So if he gets to shoot, it's really bad, like really bad. But he also goes on three, it looks like, yeah, he's on three. So, uh, I'm going to jump away from him. Engaging jump jets. And shoot him once, miss, which is fine. But I do not want to be near that guy. No damage detected. Ah! The asset is taking damage, Commander. That hurt. Warning. Internal damage. Ow! Warning. Armor breached. Order. All right. Internal damage. So... Things need to happen now. Let's bring you down here. Alright. Uh... Why is your shot so bad? Obstructed, that's why. Obstructed on both of them? Oh, that guy's moved. All right, so you're obstructed on him, which is fine. Target size, target moved. So we're going to precision strike you. All right, so the goal here is to get enough damage on him to capture the mech. I can headshot him, which is a 2% chance and wouldn't get it. Only, only worked with the AC-5. So we're going to go for a leg. Targeting for a time. Plan is what can if we I do get for him you? to fall down, we can get some damage on him. Don't need to tell me twice. All right, why don't you multi-target? All right, and you and you shoot him. Line him up, and I'll shoot him down, Commander. You did nothing to the commando. Yes, Commander. Alright, 
the Vindy's gonna jump closer. Lifting off. Alright, uh he needs to die. Engaging with target. Vindy's dead. Hostile removed. Because my spider needs to get the heck out of here. Alright, so you need to jump far, far away. Like that far away. No, oh, that's gonna make you very unhappy. Why don't you run far, far away, like to there? Full throttle. Okay. Because that's a really, really mean, nasty guitar right there looking at you in the face. Alright. Can you get a side shot on him from anywhere? Nope, you cannot. Alright. Alright, right, so he's going on two. Let's put some damage on him. Got him unsteady. Waiting on you, Commander. That's good. You also can't get anywhere to get a good side shot on him either. Coordinate received. Ready for orders. I want to move further than that, though. Hmm. Alright, we'll take this one. Alrighty. Firing on target. Alright, well, he's got a negative chance to hit, and we've got some stuff, and the indicator gets blown up. Not too bad. Damage is minor, Commander. Alright. So he's going on three again, so you need to run around the side here. Precision shotting to bring his targeting down. Shoot a leg. All resistance committed. That's his shoot a leg. Ready for orders. All right. All right. Got him on the unsteady Good to again. Go. All right, you're overheating because of all these medium lasers making you sad. Got it. Receiving you. Aye, aye. All right. Turn off the medium, and he's happy. Target acquired. All right. Got a turret. Uh, Target taken. A critical hit. All right. So we are going to reserve down. Allow him to go. Alright, now we're gonna try to get him on the ground. I'm showing minor damage. Location confirmed. Here it comes. His legs Waiting not off for orders! Shoot him in the back. Isn't all that helpful. You can jump to here. Engaging jump jets. Still not down. Warning. Heat exceeding recommended level. Alright. Uh huh. Standing by. Position confirmed. Nope. Didn't happen. Target neutralized. Alright. Took a little damage Mission on that successful. one, but... Picked up a Kentaro piece. 
So if I remember correctly, if you core him, you get one piece on a one to three system. If you take out both legs, you get two pieces. And if you take him, if you kill the pilot by head capping or doing enough damage without taking out both legs or the center torso, then you get three pieces. But I'm not 100% sure. So, take the Kentaro piece, obviously. Uh, commando piece, we don't have any of those. It's an AC2 Commando. Um, doesn't super matter because we're going to get all of it. Alright, well, one piece of a Kentaro. Another eight, nine years, we'll have three pieces, probably. We're never going to find the uh, UNK variants in the shop, so chances of us finding three pieces of that are pretty slim. SOS in the deep periphery. Everyone needs to hear this. I've picked up a radio chat between spacers and a distress signal was received a week ago originating from the deep periphery. I confirmed the story and it seems a resupply jump ship for a scientific expedition received a warning message about unknown attackers after jumping to its destination. Another one bites the dust. Why do we care about eggheads? The word is that the jump ship returned and is currently orbiting Gao and hiring mercenaries to search for the missing expedition. So, since we are desperate for contracts, to me, this might be the lucky break we were looking for. Our lucky break involves jumping into the deep periphery. We've, we're already at the edge of the civilized space, and there's nothing out there other than Kerensky's ghosts. Sumair, you know, you know all it takes is a misjump, and we'll, we will either be dead from suffocation or stranded for the rest of our lives. They were on a resupply mission, so we can assume to eventually, eventually rescue if something bad happens. And there are no ghosts out there, Yang. That's old spacer stories. I agree with Sumire. Our current operations options don't leave us much, don't leave us many options, and we should explore this. Doctor Marat, anything useful you might know about scientific expeditions in this area? Who or what might they be researching? Well, after the surveys made by Comstar's Explorer Corps were released in the previous century, there was some academic interest in this area, but there simply wasn't much funding or resources due to the war. So whoever they are. They're new to the high 80s rim. Which would explain why they got themselves into trouble. Particularly if, they, if they're if they new to the periphery and believe in the worst intersphere stereotypes about the periphery and its inhabitants. Not everyone out here is a barbarian. Contract to Gaul is... Travel contract to Gaul is ready, Commander. Now that the Arugans left the company, the overcrowded conditions should improve. That has also left us short on combat deployment options. We need to keep a close eye on morale out there. Alright. So let's go to the mech bay, and we need to fix up our spider that got crunched a little bit. Alright, it's going to take him six days. Let it run. I wrapped up that job, you. I think we got time for one more mission today. Alright. I think we will stop here and come back. To, this will be a little bit longer than a five-minute mission. It looks like a capture base on the Martian planet, one and a half stars. Uh, so we will come back tomorrow with a downloading in progress, uh, where we will probably get our butt kicked. I will see you, Mech Warriors, tomorrow. OBG out.